How to reshape a baseball glove to improve its durability. Baseball gloves need to have a curvy shape on forward to catch a ball more perfectly. But the problem is it can bend in backward after a long time use. Most players believe that they can't fix this problem and thought the only solution is go for a new one. But you can relax to know that it has a solution. Bending backward doesn't mean it's the ending of your favorite glove. You can fix a glove that's been broken in the wrong by reshaping it. Today we discussed about how to reshape a baseball glove and fix its wrong broken in problem. Also, by doing this, you can improve its durability for a couple more years. So why do you need to reshape a baseball glove? Wrong break-in and bending after long times are common problems between all baseball gloves for every position. The bending problem can happen on both new and old baseball gloves. Having a curve on the glove helps a player to catch a ball and keep it on the pocket. But after long use, the curvy shape can break in for absorbing more impact that comes straight from baseball bats. In other cases, it can also happen when you are trying to break in a new glove or MLB catcher's mitt. Difference between break-in and reshaping. Break in a baseball glove and reshaping it isn't same. Breaking in means soften a baseball glove and making it game ready when it is new. And reshaping a glove means giving curved shape on old baseball glove or softball glove while it's continuously bending backward. Most people make the mistake by thinking broken in means reshaping. But the reality is those two processes are totally different. How to reshape a baseball glove? Reshaping a glove isn't a challenging and time-consuming process. One full day 24 hours is more than enough to do. Just follow these steps to reshape your glove. Step 1. Use baseball oils to soften. Like breaking a glove, you need to use a lot of oils to make it soften. Make sure you are using a leather-friendly glove oils, because low-quality oil can damage your glove rather than improving its softness. Once I made that mistake too. After one week, I realized that my glove's color got darkened and started damaging by tearing up its laces. T first, take a piece of damp cloth and spray the oils on it. Then start applying the oil in the glove by that cloth from thumb to flat palm. Don't directly spray oils on a baseball glove, because it can change your glove's natural color into dark. Step 2. Put a ball on the pocket. After oiling and softness in your glove, now it's time for actual reshaping. For reshape, take a baseball and put it on the pocket. If you are a baseball player and trying to reshape glove, then use a baseball. But if you are a softball player and trying to fix a softball glove, then using softball will be the best. Step 3. Tie it with rubber bands. Putting a ball on the pocket and pressing helps a glove to bend, but you need to do it for a whole day. You can't just press your glove for 24 hours continuously, so you have to tie them up by something. Three quarters rubber bands will be enough for this. Tie the glove with those rubber bands. Don't force, be natural. Step 4. Let it dry for a day. You've done the most important part of reshaping an old glove already. Now it's time to dry it and making it game ready. We recommend you dry the glove under fan or natural air. Drying a baseball glove into an oven, air heater, or under sunlight can be harmful. Reshaping a glove in the oven can create sparkle, and drying in sunlight damages leather. So better to dry it naturally in a cool place or under a fan. After 24 hours, untie the glove from rubber bands and give it a good shake. After doing all of the stuff, your glove should be transformed into a curvy shape in forwards. Should I reshape a new baseball glove? No, reshaping means fixing a glove's backward bending problem. If you buy a new glove, it's impossible to have this kind of problem in it. But even after that, if you get a glove with a little curve and have to do it more, the process is the same. Hence, it's not a good sign of an ideal glove that coming with bending problems. You should return it as soon as possible. Why you need to use a new glove that has a problem since it made while you can get better than this with the same budget. Can I use shaving cream to reshape my glove? Yes, you can use it in the reshaping method, but not in every glove. Shaving cream is not recommended for suede type leather, vinyl, or any low quality glove. You can use it if you are trying to fix a stiff leather gloves wrong broken in problem. 
Example, steer hide leather, pro stock blonde, etc. First of leather, it's useful, but in soft glove, it damages its leather layer. Is it possible to use Vaseline as the alternative of baseball oil? Yes, you can use Vaseline as the alternative of baseball oil. Like shaving cream, Vaseline doesn't have restrictions of leather like pro stock or steer hide. Specialist of Wilson Glove claimed that using Vaseline doesn't harm the leather. But as no, there is a difference between oil and Vaseline. And the difference is about efficiency. At the end, Vaseline doesn't impact damage on leather, but it's not useful as oil. Is saddle soap good for reshaping a glove? No, for reshaping gloves, saddle soap isn't good at all. The main fact is there is no use of saddle soap in curving a glove. If you can't find oils, then use shaving cream. Even if you can't find cream, then search for some petroleum jelly will do your work. But if you can't get any one of them, then wait until you save some money to buy some baseball oils. Using saddle soap for cleaning gloves can be possible, but for the reshape process. Nah, in summary, as I first said, curving a glove and fixing its break-in problem isn't hard and not something to worry about. The summary of how to reshape a baseball glove is Use oil and soften it. Put a ball on pocket. Tie it with rubber bands. Then leave it for 24 hours. After this little process, you are ready to play with your favorite glove for season.